Hello, sports fans, sports better YouTube Nation. John here with Rigget Picks. Hope everybody's having a great and happy Monday. Um, going to the NBA. I have a free NBA pick for you guys uh, in a game between the uh, Los Angeles Lakers and the Utah Jazz. Uh, had an NBA pick out there. Uh, I was pretty confident in the Wizards plus two. I uh, thought that line was a little suspect, but apparently the Brooklyn Nets got way more on their bench than I thought they did, and they took care of business. And or the Wizards are not all there, so... You know, I'm watching fading the Wizards now as probably a thing to do. Uh, lesson learned. Um, as always, with all my bets, I do learn lessons. Win, lose, or draw, there's something to be learned and, uh, you know, pay attention to. So, for this game, we got the Lakers and the Jazz. Um, Jazz are typically a pretty good defensive team. Um, so far, they have played two games, um, the Utah Jazz, since being in the bubble. They played on July 30th. They lost to, or they beat the New Orleans Pelicans 106 to 104, and then August 1st they lost to the OKC um, 94 to 110. Um, the Lakers also have played two games since being back. Their first game they beat the Clippers 103 to 101. Uh, we were on the Lakers for that game on the money line, and that was a winner. And then they um, just got beat by Toronto. The Raptors. I think the Raptors are there to play. Uh, they played excellent defense. They held the Lakers to 92 points. I'm not sure that LeBron and Anthony Davis are completely on the same page yet, but I think they're going to get there soon. Um, it looks like for the Utah Jazz, of course, Bogdanovic is uh, out for the season, and it looks like O'Neal has been or, or O'Neilly has been upgraded to probable for this game. And the Lakers, um, they just got Rondo that's out six to eight weeks. Um, no, no, no big deal there. That's been common knowledge. Um, the last 10 head-to-head -head matches, Utah actually has an advantage over the Lakers. They beat them six times to uh, four losses. However, the last three, the Lakers are 3-0 and versus Utah, and the average score is 109 to uh, 97. So not only have they beat them, they've, they've taken care of business and, and whipped them pretty good. Um, on the season, offenses, uh, the Lakers are averaging 113.82 points. Utah is averaging 110 points. Um, can't really take a lot of that season average into since they've been in the bubble, since it is a di different atmosphere, different circumstances, different situation. You know, we, and we've seen some trouble from some teams already arguing with each other. I mean, you hang out with guys for too long, you know, you're not going to be on the same page. Or you're just going to be, uh, you know, glued together on the same page, locked, focused, loaded, ready to go. And I think LeBron's going to bring that leadership to the Lakers to keep them focused and, and say, hey, you know, we're going to be here. we got to be here. We're going to get through this. We're going to do this, this, and this. You know, yes, we're going to focus on the other stuff that we're focusing on. And then we're going to get down to business. So I like the Lakers here, uh, minus the six. I currently see it at minus 110. It's basically minus 110 either way, whether you take Utah plus six or the Lakers minus six. So I'm going to ride with the Lakers minus six um, for a half unit play. That's going to be your official Ricketts Hardwood pop pick for this game. And uh, we're going to see what happens. Um, NBA is the NBA. Um, a lot of over-under talk. I try to steer clear of those. I'm, I don't have a real good feel for that. Sometimes I do. Um, anytime there's a jazz game, I like to take the under because they're a defensive club and they like to play under. They don't They don't have a really high-powered offense, and they play really good defense. So, you know, I would lean to the under in this game probably, but I'm going to steer clear of it. And uh, just go with the Lakers minus six is the official play. Half a unit minus 110. If you guys have not already, hit that subscribe button, tap the bell, turn your notifications on. You'll get the videos as soon as they drop. You know, roll with your boy John here. Let's make some money. Hit that thumbs up if you appreciate true free daily sports betting advice. Hope everybody has a great and happy Monday. Thank you very much for watching this video.